Hi friends, it's Gone Films and welcome to my BTS photo card binder setup video. So today I'm doing it. I am finally starting my BTS Namjoon photo card collection. To be fair, it's Namjoon focused, but I do have a bias line. Yes, sue me, like Namjoon and Jungkook are my alt biases, but I understand that collecting for Jungkook is literally so, so expensive. So I'm focusing on collecting for Namjoon first and also a little bit of Yoongi, a little bit of Taeyang. The four of them are like part of my bias line. So eventually I do want to get uh, at least their album photo cards. But again, it's really, really expensive to collect for, you know, four members, not to say even seven members. Uh, I cannot believe some people who collect OT7 because that is literally amazing. Like the amount of time, dedication, money, effort into looking up all those photo cards and buying them for a good price like it is all insane to me so i'm starting off real small i'm starting by just collecting namjoon but if i do see a couple yoongi cards there i will definitely snatch because their cards are amazing the first part of this video will be me uh, unboxing my photo card haul and then the second part of this video will be me setting it up in my binder. So please do not judge me because I'm not a, you know, seasoned photo card collector. I really just want this collection to be my own and I figured putting them in a binder uh, will actually allow me to flip through this way more often because right now all my merch is just in boxes on a shelf. But yes, please understand I am not a seasoned collector. Um, I think everyone wants to store their collection in a different way and I think it's really cool because I've been looking up so many uh, photo card collection videos. Um, I just really wanted this to be my own, uh, to be my own style, my own preference and with the materials I had. So without further ado, um, I'll flip over to the haul and the binder setup and I'll see you in the outro. Welcome back to another video of me being an absolute fool and <laughs> spending more money on BTS. So again, like you heard from the intro, I've decided to start collecting for Namjoon. And so Namjoon, Namjoon, I just switch between those two pronunciations so much. I'm so, so sorry if that is annoying to anyone. And no, I will not stop doing it. I sort of went on a buying spree um, on Instagram. So, oops. <laughs> and before I found out the good prices on Nyokyo, I... I figured like with all the shipping and consolidation fees um, added in already, I figured that buying it on Instagram um, for some of them just might be the easier option anyways. So here's one from Min Gloss. Her name's Sophia. Oh gosh, here he is. Here he is. So I don't really remember the version names for all of these, so please excuse me on that. He is so cute. I absolutely love this card so much. His cute little dimples, like, are we kidding? It's funny because I bought these so long ago that I sort of forgot what I bought. So it's sort of a surprise every time I open it. Let's see what we have here. Wait, it's stuck on something. Oh, okay. Oh, I know what this is. Oh, I'm so excited for this. It's another one of Namjoon's Persona photo cards. Uh, wow, okay. He is so adorable and I absolutely love this card. And now I have my two alt biases. I have Jungkook's already. So um, yeah, I'm super, super happy. I love this set so, so much. And this next one is also slightly ridiculous that I had to buy, but for collection purposes, I was like, I guess this is what I have to do now. Guess this is my life. I bought this on Instagram from Cookies Giggles if you wanna buy from them. Pull this out real quick. Oh, she also included some um, Tata post-it notes. Very cute. Oh, I feel so bad because she also like did this purposely so that I can reuse the card, but like I ripped it, oops. <laughs> and I also ripped out the tag, love that for me. It's fine though. This is one of Namjoon's answer photo cards. Um, I love this set as well. And I luckily pulled Yoongi already. So another one down and honestly, he just looks so good. He looks so fine, so, so fine. The next few things I have is a first 
something that I've been looking forward to for a really long time and this will definitely help in my photo card collection. Um, so this person is Andrea. He's honestly so, so pleasant and um, super, super nice. So I'm very excited. She has this tiny tan um, washi tape, which I think is so adorable. Ah, there he is. Okay, hold on. So here's this Namjoon PC, hold on. Oh, all this BTS tape, oh my gosh. I feel bad ripping it apart, but <laughs> it's okay. Okay, oh my God, uh, I forgot <laughs> that I got two Namjoon photo cards from her. So I'm just gonna open it here. This is Namjoon's her card. I forget which version, I'll put it up on the screen here, but he honestly looks so cute, so freaking adorable. I love um, all the her concepts. And the next card I have is Namjoon's Persona card. I also don't know what version this is, um, but he looks so good. So I'm very, very excited for these. And lastly, um, in this mini haul is this, which uh, took a very, very long time to get. It was a Twitter seller. <laughs> it just took a super, super long time to get to me. So um, I'm very excited to open this as well. And so, like I said earlier, this is from Twitter. It says, thank you. Hope everything arrives to you safely and fast. Let me know when you get this. Ah, okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. This is quite a lot. Hold on. So a bunch of mini freebies here. Oh my gosh. This is so cute. She also included a keychain, which is like, what the heck? Um, I believe this is Jin and the keychain is so cute. It's in the shape of a heart. Here is the star of the show, uh, this Yoongi Persona PC, which I'm really, really glad to have. It's a little bit scuffed in the back, but honestly, that's okay with me. I'm not picky with that kind of stuff. I'm just glad to have him in my hands, finally. Oh my gosh. A little bit damaged in the back, um, but that's okay with me. She sold me this BTS World album as well, which I don't have BTS World already, so I was excited to have this, um, especially this um, little ticket thing. Quick look through here. Oh my gosh, this take hook, are you kidding? So freaking cute. Some of these, I honestly forget when I actually bought them, but it's definitely been a while because they've been in my haul stack for a pretty long time. This is Tay's Persona PC. I forget which version. I should probably know that already, but here he is. Um, he is so beautiful. This is the Love Yourself World Tour in Europe. So I previously bought the New York and the Seoul one, so I really wanted the Europe one, but it's actually much more difficult to find this one than all the other ones for some reason. I have no idea why, but it's even more difficult to have it come with the photo card. Oh my god. Zoom in on this because he is just so beautiful. Like, look at this. Look at this. Here is the DVDs, they look beautiful. And then here is the postcard that came with this. So beautiful and not even any scratches or anything, literally in perfect condition. Love that, they look so good here. And lastly, the photo book, I'm just gonna do a quick flip through. This actually is not damaged at all. This is in great condition, so. Super excited about that. At least my $100 was well spent. Oh, yes. Here are the DVDs next to each other. Like, look at this. Look at this. This is so freaking satisfying. Like, how can you not love this? And when you put all the DVD spines together, you can see there's a little bit of a design here, which is freaking gorgeous. This is just so satisfying. Like, are you, are we kidding? Are we freaking kidding? This is gonna look fantastic on my shelf. The last thing I have in this mini photo card haul is um, something that has been, uh, I've been waiting to come in the mail for quite a bit now, but I'm so excited. It's finally here. All right, let's pull it out. 
Ah, here he is. Okay, so here's a bunch of freebies, cute little stickers, and here is Taeyang. Oh my gosh. And this photo card is in literal perfect condition. He just looks so good here. Like, wow. <laughs> So first things first, let me just get one thing straight. I am not collecting for OT7 just yet um, because that is super overwhelming to me. So right now I'm aiming to collect Namjoon, Jungkook, who are both my biases, and then also Taeyong and Yoongi, who are my bias wreckers. So you can see here I had these extra like post-it notes, sticky things that I thought were super cute. Um, so I put green for Namjoon, brown for Jungkook, Taeyong's this cute little bear, and then and Yoongi is of course is this cat and I just think all these uh, stickers really embody them very well and they're so cute so these are my placeholders for now and also because I didn't have a bunch of these white placeholders and I didn't want to cut them so the way I set up my nine pocket pages is I have an album um, design here and then a couple of fillers here as well I just think this setup is super cute um, for a four page spread so I don't have any thing for are you late too so let's just skip past that for school love affair i got namjoon's photo card so i'll put this here and i also set up my binder um a little bit in advance just to save up on time so i put um the stickers here eventually i'm hoping to get the other three and just have them all in one page spread and then put this sticker somewhere but for now um it'll just be here um, here is a, another four page spread. I don't have um, a binder design for this yet because I'm a fool and I <laughs> printed it out vertically instead of horizontally so I'm just using these placeholders for now. And I also don't have um, the three other placeholders so this page is a little bit empty but eventually um, I'll fill the placeholders in for this. For Dark and Wild, I also don't have anything. So you can see here, this is um, ideally a horizontal spread. So just two up here, two down here, and then the four in the middle. I don't know, I just, I like this layout more. And especially because the cards are laid out horizontally as well. Um, I got special pages for that. Uh, this page is for HYYH part one. I have Yoongi, he looks so freaking good here. I absolutely love this um, photo card set. I don't know, I might collect OT7 for this eventually just because I think this set is uh, really pretty. And HYYH part two, again, I have Yoongi, Mint Yoongi, he looks so beautiful, wow. And I really like how I did the ombre spread here. I don't know, I, I think it's just super satisfying to look at. This is an empty page because I have Jin and Taeyong from Young Forever. Um, I know I'm not collecting for Jin, but I did pull him, so he's going here for now. When I get the other three, I'll eventually fill up this page, but for now, I'll fill up the last spot here with this Taeyong Wing sort of card because I also pulled him in an album. Let's see, for You Never Walk Alone, I unfortunately didn't pull anyone here. Love Yourself L, I have Jungkook. I freaking love this set so much. Actually, this whole album series, like Love Yourself Her had such great concepts and photo cards. They're so, so pretty. Um, unfortunately, they go for quite a bit, especially Taeyong and um, Jungkook, but luckily I pulled Jungkook for this. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't blame the sellers for sort of um, overpricing this because this whole Love Yourself Her series is beautiful, but I don't know. Some of these cards are going for a bit much. Especially this one, I've seen this go for like $30, which is more than the album, and I just don't think uh, that's realistic. But yes, luckily I pulled him as well. This, I didn't pull uh, anyone, but I do have these filler photo cards. My friend gifted me, um, you know, these mock photo cards, so I'd like to keep them in here just because I have them already, so I'll leave them in here. For version E, I have Namjoon, 
which funny story my sister actually pulled him and she really freaking loves that photo card so so much so i had to buy one myself so now we each have this namjoon photo card moving on to tier i have namjoon which luckily i pulled because he looks freaking beautiful honestly the concepts for tier as well are super pretty for Taeyong, I got, um, I'm sorry, for version O, I have Taeyong, which I also love this concept. I keep saying I love the concept of this and love the concept of that, but honestly, they just all look really good. I didn't um, have anyone for you, so for version R, I have this Taeyong. Moving on to Answer, I have this Yoongi, which I pulled Yoongi basically for all four albums of answer and um, i'm not mad about it but <laughs> it was just it was just funny um so version e yeah i don't have anyone for that but for version l i have namjoon's here and also yoongi and version f the version that literally everyone loves and it's super super hard to get a hold of any of the cards Although I'd love to um, get OT7 for this set too one day, but then again, so does everyone else. I have Yugi's for this. He looks so freaking adorable. This whole set is just so cute. Uh, but again, also super expensive because it's highly sought out. Starting with Persona, I have Namjoon. And again, I have a funny story about my sister. She literally pulled Namjoon and then lost the card. So I had to buy this again. Oh my freaking gosh. But fortunately, I pulled Jungkook. So uh, my biases are all there. I just need to get Taeyong and Yoongi's as well. But this is another popular set that everyone really enjoys. So it's going to be hard to find them for that. And this page, ooh, I love this page because I bought and pulled my bias line so here we go let's try to complete this page this is a persona version 2 this is going to be so satisfying to look at all of this together like wow like look at this look at this this is such a big serotonin boost. Oh my goodness. Love this page so, so much. And then version three. And version four, I don't believe I have any of them. So I will skip that for now. And then I have the OT7 set for uh, the Persona postcards. So I'll be putting this in. And for anyone asking about the order, uh, I just did my bias line. So Namjoon, Jungkook, Taeyong, and Yoongi. And then, um, I don't know, it's just an order of favoritism, I guess. <laughs> Which is very controversial because I know a lot of people um, do it in either age order or fan chant order. But I don't know, for me, I'm just, I, I'd like it to be in order of favorites. Just because if I did it in order of uh, fan chan or age order, then my two favorites would be at the end, and that just didn't make sense to me. So yes, I know it's very controversial, and I recognize that. But hey, listen, it's everyone's binder is their personal choice on how they want to organize it. So here it is. Here's my order. I mean, I love all of them so, so much. Don't get me wrong, love OT7. But again, if I did it in order of fan chant or age, then my two favorites would be at the end and that just doesn't make sense to me. And now we are on to Up of the Soul 7. Version one, I don't really have anyone. Version two, fortunately, I pulled Taeyong. And his uh, red eyeliner eyeshadow moment going on here is absolutely gorgeous. Like, wow, look at him. He looks amazing. Version three, I have Namjoon's. And then version four, I don't believe I pulled anyone. Actually, we did pull, um, me and my sister did pull Taeyong, but she has that in her photo, in her phone case right now. So this place is empty. <laughs> 
For B, I also pulled Namjoon. Thankfully, he looks so beautiful here. And then this will be a page for the B Essential and B Deluxe photo cards. Which I'm so grateful that they did a full set of photo cards for these because that just shows how much they love us and they know how whipped we are for photo cards. So yeah, I mean, the more photo cards, the better. Look at this. Oh my gosh, this is so, so satisfying. Amazing, 10 out of 10. And then here is the Deluxe photo cards. And I also included um, this OT7 spot in uh, this spread just because it's horizontal. And this Polaroid was also um, part of the deluxe edition. So I'm putting it here. And thanks to a big hit, they actually posted um, this like Polaroid photo uh, on their Twitter. So I printed it out on my Polaroid printer. This I believe goes very well with the Polaroid that they had given us in the album. And then these were from the Life Goes On MV shooting, which I just think is so cute and so perfect for this set. So thankfully, a big hit posted that for everyone. Bless. I just, uh, look at this of Taya. Wow. Like this, this is it. The Polaroid is a bit small for these pockets, so they tend to slide around, but maybe one day I'll get back to it and actually sleeve them properly. And this is the um, BTS pre-order postcard. And then the last page that I have for photo cards is just uh, cards of other members that I'm not really collecting for. So this is sort of um, miscellaneous pulls from albums. I have a few of Jin, oops, one Hobie, a couple of Jimin's as well. I realized I could trade these, um, you know, for my bias line, but I figured one day I might end up collecting OT7, so I might as well just keep them for now. And this was the group card that I pulled for You Never Walk Alone. Uh, this is for Are You Late 2. And then this was just a group card that I had from the DICON magazine that didn't fit into my other nine page spread. So I'll leave this here for now. And the last few things I have for this binder is um, album inclusion. So this is from Love Yourself, Her, and Answer. Other lenticular uh, slash like transparent things from Tear, BTS World, and also uh, the Persona albums. Also postcards from the Moth 7 albums. Stickers and the coloring page from the Moth 7 album, which is also super cute of them to include. These are from their B Deluxe album. And lastly, I have the album notes that I just put in these four pocket pages here. All right, so let's do one final flip through. that video I know some people may not be into you know photo card binder collecting and all that but I just think it's really soothing and really relaxing and at least there was also a mini haul at the beginning so I hope you guys enjoyed it um, I just really think that BTS have become like my new hobby my new obsession and it's just really really fun and exciting for me uh, to put some effort into collecting albums and collecting photo cards and then setting it up in a binder I don't know I just find all of that super super satisfying and so I just wanted to thank you guys for watching. I really, really do appreciate it. And leave a comment down below if you also have like an album, merch, or photo card collection. I'd love to hear your stories. I'd love to hear how you are storing this, um, what you plan to do next with your collection. All that stuff is just really, really interesting to me. So don't be afraid to leave a comment down below. Let's have a conversation about it.
If you haven't seen my last video, I will leave a card up here and also a card at the very end. Um, I do a bunch of other BTS videos as well, like trying to get BTS concert tickets, um, BTS haul videos, things like that. So please, if you're an ARMY or fellow ARMY, please feel free to peruse through my videos because, I mean, as ARMYs, we gotta stick together, right? Again, thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. I hope you liked it. Please remember to subscribe and hit that like button if you enjoyed this video as much as I did. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!